Hello, I'm Mal, and welcome back to XCOM The Long War Beta 14. Well, we are getting down, I think, <laughs> towards the last stretch of this. Um, if you didn't catch the last episode, I did clear out Australia and momentarily control the entire world. However, due to panic, Egypt left at uh, the very end of the month, so I have already launched a satellite, and we will be doing a base assault to take Egypt back. I don't have to! Uh, necessarily, but I want to, and obviously the extra funding from this bonus is good to have as well, so uh, let's take a look here, just kind of a quick status thing. Here's how we're looking in terms of our interceptor fleet. So we either have a firestorm and then fully upgraded interceptors with laser cannons or something to that effect. I'm building one more laser cannon for this interceptor. Um, or we have two firestorms sitting on a particular continent. So that's what we got there. And actually, yep, nope, that looks good. Uh, let's take a look at the queue. Got some side training coming up. Blaster launcher in two days. Oh, that'll be fun. Oh, okay. Well, failure. Darn it. All right, well, let's send her again. Add soldier. Christy, come here, Christy. Yeah, I want you to have mind control. So, another seven days. Hopefully Copley will get his this time. Uh, let's see. What else is coming up? Oh, uh, da, 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 da. That laser cannon. Our mine and machine research to progress the story along will be done in seven days. And then I queued up, I sold all that stuff uh, that we got from the last base assault, or most of it. And then I queued up uh, another Archangel armor. Yep. Okay. So, let's scan. Copy. Failure. Alright. So be it. So that's the... Third time or fourth time he's failed and I don't even have a spot in there to put him back in do I yeah I do okay well we'll send him again and I don't know if this is the third or fourth time but I'm getting really tired of sending him so let's go again he'll get it eventually right that's why I keep telling myself scout low okay scramble interceptors He should be able to handle this. Okay, maybe not. Wow. What is that thing? Oh, it's a raider. Oh. Yeah. I don't know how effective my little interceptors are going to be on this thing. Okay, abort. Grab another one. We do have the all of the foundry upgrades, including the super capacitors for the lasers. We got it. We got a crash site. Now it <laughs> it took three interceptors, but hey, better than nothing, right? That's why I have those guys covering the place that has the least amount of uh, panic level. Okay, so we've got a scout target. Okay, we've got Raider with 19 crew, Ethereal, Mutant Elite, Mectoid, Sectoid, Sectoid Commander, Outsider, and Sectopod. Wow, that's a no-joke Raider. Whoa. Okay, well, let me set up a team for this, and I'll be right back with you. Okay, folks, so we'll look at the team in just a second, but before I do that, there's actually a couple items I wanted to queue up to build. The first is this Plasma Stellarator. Now, this is the small item... Uh, that increases your damage to plasma weapons. This got unlocked when we did that other research project. So let's go ahead and build some of these. Um, hmm. 306 bucks. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so let's get three of those cooking and then... I had the suggestion of building some plasma pistols, which I think is a good idea, so... 
Can we afford two? No. And we only have one alien pistol, so... Alright, well... We could build an alien pistol, or we could build the Mauler. Which is the heavier duty version. You lose, like, a little bit of mobility, but this thing is, like, stout in terms of damage. Eh, let's build this. Okay. Now we're basically broke. <laughs> let's go look at the team. Oh, we're gonna have some fun, people. We're gonna have some fun. So starting off on the left, we've got Nico, our Goliath mech, Mech 3 Paladin suit, Particle Cannon, Kinetic Strike Module, Electro Pulse, Flamethrower, and the Thumper. And then, oh, what do we got here? Oh, <laughs> Blaster Launcher, that's right! So, Dark Star here, our Rocketeer, Aegis Armor, Plasma Storm Gun, the Blaster Launcher. Let's look at that in more detail, shall we? 9 to 17 damage, effective long range, and if you've never seen these things before, these things are awesome. You just, they have like little homing plasma missiles, <laughs> and they just fly around corners or whatever. They are crazy. So, yeah, uh, this should be pretty fun. We got a spare rocket, a spare shutter rocket, and a scope. All right. Next. We've got Christine Davis, who's really primarily coming just for experience. And I wanted to I wanted to actually have this be a capture group because I wanted to try to get um, another alien rifle. But um, I just I, I ended up scrapping the idea of trying to get any captures on it. Maybe we'll go for captures in another mission, but not this one. So she's just here primarily for experience. Titan Armor, Plasma Carbine, Laser Pistol, Double Set of Chem Grenades, and Walker Servos. And actually, you know what? Her mobility is not all that important, so maybe I'll have her carry some Ghost Grenades instead. 13 mobility is just fine. And she's not trying to capture. Odette's leading this. Colonel Officer Gunner, Seraph Armor, Plasma, Plasma Dragon. Uh, armor piercing ammo, alloy bipod, and a scope. And then we have our rapid fire gunner, Master Sergeant, aka, well, Anaya, aka Geronimo, Titan armor, plasma nova gun, neural gun link, armor piercing ammo, and a scope. Now her mobility is not that great. Maybe I should. Yeah, let me give up the armor piercing for some walker servos. That makes more sense, I think. Yeah. Okay, next we've got Bradley, since Colby is back in side training yet again. Archangel armor, plasma sniper rifle, laser pistol sidearm, neural gun link, a scope, and the illuminator gun sight. Long shot. She's redeemed herself recently. <laughs> She's been doing much better. Seraph armor, reflex rifle, laser pistol sidearm, marksman scope, regular scope, and chitin plating, just in case she does get hit, because she's a little bit squishy with only 5 base health. Hydra is coming as our medic. Aegis armor, plasma carbine, laser pistol sidearm, a set of mimic beacons, a set of ghost grenades, and two medkits. I think I probably want to switch this. Yeah, we're going we're to need more medkits, just in case we get hit. If nothing else, the mech might need them. Right? Okay. Looks good. Let's go. Pretty nasty UFO that we're going to go do right now, actually. Dropship has arrived. Brazilian authorities have requested our help, so that's where we're going next. The downed UFO is in a remote area outside a small town. If we can secure the crash site, we should be able to prevent any civilian casualties. All right, here we go. Sky. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is. No, nope. I was gonna say, is that the UFO? Nope, uh, that's the Sky Ranger. So this way, I'm guessing. Yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, Nico, let's go. And move and move. I'm on it, Commander. I'm 
Okay. Esper, go over here. Roger. I've got my eyes on. And in the turn. It's gonna tell somebody's to the right. No? Okay. Moving out. UFO over there? Yeah, should be. Okay, so Davis, move up. Heavy metal. You know what? Why don't you go ahead and dash up there? Hydra can go there. Ronimo, hang out there. Long shot. Dark Star. Bradley. Hmm, to our right. I'm shocked! <laughs> That's what always happens. You'll be moving towards the, the UFO and then you'll you'll hear a group. Alright, that's fine. Let's set up for that then. Toggle flight. Mm-hmm. And say here. Yep. And push our engineer up. Yep, that way we can use your cam grenades. Dark Star. Right here. Steady weapon. Long shot. Right here. And throw a battle scanner. Big Brother is online. Ah, hi guys. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have some fun with these guys. You just wait. I'm on my way. Let's move up right here. And we'll set Overwatch. Hydra. You can go right there. Overwatch. And... Need a good spot. Okay, you can put Geronimo right here. This should be okay. Overwatch. Overwatch. And then Casper, let's go airborne, buddy. Steady weapon, and in the turn. Now, hopefully it's not a patrol, but if it is, we're set up. So either way, actually, either way, it's fine. Okay, they didn't move much. Now, <laughs> let's see, blaster launcher? Oh yeah, that's happening. Here we go. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> okay, did we need to do that? No, absolutely not. But it was awfully fun. You have to admit. Okay, so let me slow this down a little bit. Moving out. Mm-hmm. Flamethrower, these guys. Maybe this guy will run out of cover. That'd be cool. Why don't you move? Nope, he didn't. All right, fine. Be that way. I'm on the move. Okay, let's move up. Forty-one percent. That's not that great. Okay, I think I'll Overwatch back here. Hunker here. Hydra. You know what? Let's do this. Let's throw. Mimic beacon right there. Get these guys to come up. Yep, in which case we need to move Odette back. Yep. A little further. And we'll toss a Kim grenade right there on top of the Mimic beacon. Okay, now. Yeah, where's the one that has, like, low health? Where are you? Hmm. I mean, that one's out of cover. You know what? Let's do damage to that one. A 
Come to the Mimic Beacon. Thank you. Oh, right past Close Combat Specialist. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. And hopefully dead guy. Yep, dead guy. Enemy unit eliminated. All right, so let's see. Hi, how you doing? And how are you? Not so good. <laughs> okay, so this guy's toast. Yep. And our engineer. Let's see if we can get her a kill. If it crits... Nope, she's got a hit to get it done. Alright, well... See if we'll get her a kill somewhere else. Done. Reload. Alright, so four down. Fifteen to go. And I think I'll leave the sniper up here, actually, for now. Yeah, I see no reason not to. There we go. Steady weapon. Steady weapon. Reload. There we go. Reposition a bit. Okay, Odette, come on down, because you're going to have to move up with the team. Uh-huh. Okay, Geronimo. Move up. Reload. Engineer can move here. Reload. Steady weapon. Steady weapon. Steady weapon. Move Nico over. There's something out there. Mm, I know it. Oh, hi. Should get. Yeah, I was gonna say. Where's our reaction fire? I know we've got some. There we go. Good shot. So let's see here. Um, let's move right there. Draw that Overwatch. Might grab another group by this move. It's possible, but since I have people in the open, I have no choice really. Oh, okay, not bad. So eighty percent. Let's hold that thought. Okay, Geronimo right here. And Davis. I think we can kill this thing right now, so... I'll just toss a Kim grenade like this. That way, if the Sectoid tries to move and flank, he'll have to move through Kim, if it survives. That Mactoid's got a lot of hit points, though. I will say that. It's too bad... It's too bad Odette's out of position. Too far back? Yeah, too far back. Okay, dash. Hmm. Actually, let's move here. And reload. Okay, where is... Yeah. I need you... To mine merge. Yep, Geronimo. So you do that. Okay, now we're ready. So let's get hollow targeting up. Yep, 
Yep, reactive targeting sensors, that's fine. Hostiles targeting my position. Yep, that's what we want them to do. Now, let's smoke this thing best we can. That was pretty good. Pretty good. Any of these guys out in the open? No. Alright, well, then we'll just take the shot right there. Well, we might not have enough to kill it this turn. It's close. It's really close. I could use a rocket. Yeah, I could use a rocket, and maybe I should? Actually, I think I will. Yeah, I, I really don't want to do this, but I don't feel like I have a choice, because that mechtoid's going to flank. Alright, let's go. Eighteen damage. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. And we'll save a couple of the shots, right, for dealing with the ethereal? Yeah. Having the blaster launcher means you can bring a rocketeer to a mission and it be worth the spot. Previous to that, at this stage of the game, it's not really worth it. At least not in beta 14. In beta 15, you could probably make a different argument. Okay, so let's see, Davis. Actually, let's just do this. Move over here and see if the sniper can deal with these guys. Really? No visibility? All right, I hope this doesn't grab another group. Oh, it did. All right. But that's not actually all bad, now that I think of it, because what we can do we can grab Odette and put her like right here. Maybe get just a tad closer for next turn. We take Geronimo. Well, we can't actually can Geronimo dash here and it be okay. No. However, we do have a scout. Uh, where are you at? Come here. Time for you to earn your pay. That's not going to be close enough, I don't think. No, probably not. All right, well, dash over there. If it is, great. And if it's not, then it's still a decent place for her to hang out for now. Okay, Hydra. Dash over here. Davis. How far can you throw Kim Grenade? Not far enough. Okay. You need to go here, which would trigger the Overwatch. How many hit points do you have? You probably have enough to survive it, and I need the Kim Grenade. All right. Good luck, Christine. She's dashing, so... Oh, didn't even trigger it. Nice! <laughs> but I was willing. I was willing to go there. Well, if that's the case, then I can relocate Geronimo. There we go. And Darkstar can go... Actually, just stay there and steady weapon. Alright, now let's take some shots. That's one drone. Nope. Well, got rid of one, so that's good. Even if the Sarctopod hits, it can't do enough damage to kill Nico, so it's fine. 
Oh, that was... Wow, that was weird. <laughs> Can I see that shot? Well, of course you did. There we go. Nice close combat shot. Mm-hmm. I saw. Good job. Four damage from a sec sectoids at this stage are kind of crazy. Yeah, a little bit. Is there something going to jump us from the right? I hope not. I'd like to deal with this group first. Yeah. Yeah, I think sectoids are a little overtuned at this stage of Long War because if you can take five damage from. Uh, yeah, if you take five damage. <laughs> From the sectopod at point blank range, basically, versus a sectoid. I mean, that's kind of silly, right? Hmm. Oh, it's the only valid shot she has. Okay, well, take it then. There we go. Okay, so let's. Should we do shooty shooty? Yeah. We definitely want to close the distance because we want shock absorbent armor to be in effect. Yeah. So we need to be within four tiles. Plus, if we don't kill it, we can. Let's see here. One, two, three, four. Okay, so right here is sufficient. Yep. And we can disable it if we need to. Okay, chem grenade. Nope, not quite close enough. How close do we need to get? Pretty close. She doesn't have, uh, what's it called yet? To that Bombard. That's why she's got to get so close. Alright, let's go like this and we can debuff that sectoid also. Mm-hmm. There we go. Good. I don't like her sitting in partial armor, but or partial cover, but uh, I think it'll be okay. That's affirmative. Need to move a little closer. All right, now Odette, hundred percent. Okay, I need. Where's the medic? Oh, 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 oh the medic. Nope, nope. Mind merge. Yep, right there, please. Okay, that should give us some good crit. Or better crit, anyway. 15, nice. Uh, I don't know how much that second one shot... I don't know how much the second shot was, but... Let's see. Now. Hi. Oh, yeah, it's going down. No problem. Matter of fact, I'll take a second shot over here. Get rid of that sectoid. Adieu. Adieu. Okay, and you can fire. And then reload. Did that kill the sectoid when it, when it fell down? No, but now we can see the sectoid. Okay, <laughs> that's weird. Well, okay, um... Reload then, you have lock and load. And then kill him. Got him. Okay, good. Good stuff. So let's reposition a bit. Go ahead and reload. And here we go. I knew there was something from the right. So we've got Sectoid Commander, two Outsiders, and a Mectoid. That's what it looks like. Okay, let's see. Well, first thing we need to do is grab Nico. Yeah, because she needs to run that Overwatch for me and provide a target for them. Yep, so let's go. Incoming. 
I want to get rid of the sectoid commander. Yeah, because, uh, you know, mind control is problematic. I wish I could destroy his cover, but I don't really have... Other than using a rocket? Which... Hmm. I could use a shredder rocket like this. It's not a bad use of a shredder rocket. Okay, let's do it. It still leaves us with one more rocket for the ethereal. Wow, 14 and shredded. That was nice, but it didn't destroy any cover. But that's that's okay. I can relocate here with the scout. I can get hollow targeting on him. Yep. And then I can take a shot. Here, let's shift a little bit. There we go. I can take a shot like this. Maybe one of those will hit. Uh, yeah, one of them did hit. Okay, and then I can flank him. Uh, hmm. Let's see. No. All right, Overwatch then. Oh, 95% chance to hit. Oh, 100%. I could kill him right now, huh? All right, hold that thought. Odette. Let's go ahead and light that one up. Yep, yeah, the mectoid. Okay, now let's kill the mectoid. That should trigger in the zone, and then we'll kill the sectoid commander. Yep, yeah, I like that plan. Yep, peace out. Okay, so now we've got a couple of outsiders who are no joke. There's no doubt about that, but they're less of a threat based on what targets they have available. As a matter of fact, where can I throw that smoke? Pretty far. All right, so let's do this. Let's move right here with our medic. Let's toss some smoke over Darkstar. So she's behind full cover, plus she has smoke, plus she's got that field, so... I don't think the field counts for her, I think it's just for allies. But they should shoot at the mech. At least I'm hoping they do. Retreating? Well, yeah, I guess I can't blame them. <laughs> they kinda got smoked. Mmm, something's back there. Alright. Let's see, how do we want to do this? Let's dash the scout up. And, and we're basically going to take a turn here. Yeah. And just sort of wait. I'll reposition and wait. See if they come back. And if they don't, we'll, uh, we'll throw a battle scanner next turn. And then try to take them out. We'll make a decision then on how we're gonna how we're gonna do it, but okay. Actually, set Overwatch. Hydra, you can move up a little bit. Actually, you know what? Let's use a mimic beacon and see if we can call them back. Mm hmm. Like right here. That might work. Overwatch. And then Geronimo. Reload. Davis. Move up. Actually, move up there. Reload. And I think I'll have you Overwatch, actually. Hi! There's the Outsider. How you doing, buddy? Nice, good shot.
Nope, not gonna come back out, huh? Alright. Well, Overwatch. Let's grab the scout. Hollow targeting up. Yeah, I mean, might as well take the shot. Good shot. Good hit. Okay, Dark Star. You just stay where you are, actually. Overwatch. And no real good place for the medic to go, so. You just hunker down back there, actually. Okay, move Geronimo up. And goodbye. Nailed him. Okay. Overwatch. And so there's what? One more outsider that's activated. Reload. Okay, move Davis back and put Moving. Geronimo there. I wouldn't be surprised if it's trying to go around too. It might, actually. Let's, do this. Let's go over here and make sure that's not happening. I got enough firepower on the right flank. Let's check this out. I mean, just, you know, make sure. On the move. Come on. I know you're there. Quit hiding. Frustrating when the aliens do this. Yeah, when they're actually kind of smart, it's annoying. They just need to be dumb all the time. All right, let's go look with the scout then, I guess. On the move. Reload. Overwatch. Let's reposition. Moving. Come on. There's something out there. Yeah, that's the ethereal. I mean, did I kill? Well, there he is. I knew he was still there. Still up. Yeah, come here. Alright, Overwatch should get him. There's a sniper shot that should go. No? Really? Alright, fine. Okay, let's see if we can do some damage with someone else. Because Hunter needs... Well, take the shot, dude. There we go. There's two people here that actually do need kills, the Engineer and the Medic. So... I can't get a flank. But I can get a proximity bonus. Nope. Alright, no problem. Sniper. Goodbye. So I think we just have the command pod, right? Which includes the ethereal, so that's kind of no joke. 
So let's set up for that. How do we want to do that? That's a good question. I think. Hmm. I guess where Darkstar is is actually a good place for her. Okay. Move the scout back in. We'll use the scout to trigger. And actually, maybe. Maybe we should throw a battle scanner in there. Not from this angle. Okay. We'll hold off here a second. Reload. Nico can come back. And actually, let's heal Nico up. So you can pull back and get a heal. We're going to need to take Odette and reposition her. Uh, we can't do anything. That's her second uh, her second move or whatever from double tap. Okay, Overwatch. Okay, we need her over like over here so she's got a better angle. Reload. Christine can stay there. Casper needs to come down a little bit so that he'll have the right angle. Reloaded. Okay, let's move here. Didn't trigger anything. And let's toss a battle scanner in here and take a look. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. So they're actually in a room or they're behind the UFO. One or the other. Easy now, soldier. Okay, let's move Nico up. If they're in here. That's okay ish. It'd be better if I mean I can knock a hole in the wall. Oh, they're up in that room. You hear that? Yeah, I hear it. Okay, how do we want to do this then? Have the engineer go look? The engineer could open the door and then run away. On the move. Like this? Not there. Uh... Hmm. They must be behind the ship then. Okay, for now, back up. Let's toggle flight and let's move up. Yes, sir. Dark Star, stay where you're at. I need them to come out to me. So we can move the scout around and try to trigger that way. Or we could even in theory have Nico do it, but whatever happens, they need to come out to us. Oh, 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 okay. I don't know how we got vision there, but oh, the mutant over there triggered. That's what happened. All right, fine. That's just fine. We're gonna move back over here where we can't be seen. And we'll deal with the mutons. And then we'll deal with the ethereal. And I'm going to reposition her this way. So that if the ethereal comes out on the right side, she'll be in position to fire on it. Okay, overwatch shot from Geronimo. Nice hit. You're going to take that shot? Oh, good. Missed. Surprised it didn't go for cover. Good hit. No, oh, not going to use double tap. I'm going to take this shot right here. Should kill him. Mm-hmm. Yep, and then reload. 
And then, actually I was gonna do steady weapon, but I think instead I'm gonna toggle flight. And get up over here. We've got another muton. That we need to deal with. Okay, let's move a little bit forward with Darkstar. Steady weapon. Hmm, Scout's a little vulnerable here. Yeah. We need to move. Back over here looks good. Okay, Nico can stay right there. Hydra, hunker down. Overwatch. Let's move the engineer out. Okay, here we go. Yep, yeah, Ethereal. Darn it. I hope that's the second move. I really, really do. If not, I might lose someone right here. Debris in optic system detected. Damn it. Enemy is still alive. Might lose Davis. Nope, oh, okay. What's the second move? Okay, that's good. Then what we're gonna do, let's grab Davis. There's still a muton floating around somewhere, but I need the Kim grenade. Or, I want the chem grenade might be a better thing to say. She can take a hit from a muton. Okay. Yeah, toss the chem grenade. And we'll use Nico's move last, because Nico could become a cover point for her. In theory, right? Geronimo, move here, Odette, no, where's the scout, right here, give me hollow targeting, nice hit, oh, good job, good job. Oh, it's going down. It's going down hard. Yep. How many points does I have left? Ten? Copy that. Mm, no shot, huh? Alright, Overwatch. Actually, let's do it like this. Pop it. Yeah, sayonara. Okay, then Overwatch. Steady weapon. Now let's go make sure stupid Mutant Elite's not coming around on us, which it probably is. Overwatch. There he is. Hi. Yeah, she's been on those Overwatch shots. Yeah. Good job. I think we'll be able to just punch this guy in the face and end this. Okay, let's see. Depending on where he is. Uh, all right, we'll go here. I'm guessing here. Oh, no, I'm not gonna be able to punch him. I don't think. Just shoot him in the face. I hear that works too. And goodbye. Mission accomplished. All right, nice. <laughs> I like it.
Okay, Carter came back to service. Good. The aliens better get it together, or we're gonna mop the floor with them. That's right, we're gonna mop the floor with them. Okay, looking pretty good. Oh, we got flight computers. What? What? You know what that means? Is it the gray market? Well, I'll do it in between episodes. That means we're building another firestorm if we can. Let's see if we can. No, I need eight flight computers. Darn it. We're still short. Exciting to see flight computers, though. It's been a long time. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, hit that thumbs up. As always, I appreciate your comments and feedback. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, I'm Mal, and I will see you later.